Hello and welcome to Infinity. Here's a picture that has got a lot of light and sort of grey tones in it, particularly because you've got a mist here of steam over these rocks. So if I try to darken this down, let's put in a curve. Uh, bring that up, here we go. So I pull this down. I'm getting a bit more coming through here, but what's happening is the very darks, look down here, things like this, are just too intrusive. Um, they're grabbing the eye. So what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to pull that one up. So you can see when I pull it up, see what happens, this goes grey because what was black is now a grey colour. And <clears throat> What I might do now is if I pull this one up a bit here, I form a kind of spoon shape. And that's sometimes useful to just grey down the darker tones, but in this case it's making this a little bit dull. So that's one shape of spoon. But I can do another shape of spoon instead. I'm going to keep that like that. And this is going to be the top of the spoon now, because I'm going to turn this into a little bit of an S curve up here like that. And this one here is going to keep this not quite so black. But now the spoon is down here. And this is up there like that. So just enough to don't want to make this too bright there. But I'm getting more contrast into the middle now without these blacks suddenly jumping out and hitting me. So there we go. There's my spoon. But Making curves look like spoons can sometimes be just what you want. Anyway, I hope you like that one and thank you very much for watching.